Understanding the phrase, read one's lips, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to dive into a fascinating English phrase, read one's lips. This expression is not just about literally reading lips, but it holds a deeper, more interesting meaning in conversations. Let's unravel its significance together. Read one's lips originates from the literal act of lip reading, where someone tries to understand spoken words by watching the speaker's lip movements, especially when hearing is difficult. In English, this phrase has taken on a figurative meaning. It's used to emphasize that what is being said is so clear that it could be understood just by lip reading, implying that the speaker's message is unmistakable and should not be questioned. This phrase is often used in situations where the speaker wants to underscore the importance or truthfulness of their words. For example, I'm not going to change my mind. Read my lips, no more delays. Read my lips, we are definitely going to win this game. In these examples, the speaker uses the phrase to convey certainty and conviction. A common misunderstanding is taking this phrase too literally. Remember, it's not about actually reading lips but about underlining the clarity and seriousness of what's being said. It's a metaphorical expression, not a literal instruction. There are variations like, let me spell it out for you, or to put it plainly, that carry a similar connotation of making something extremely clear or obvious. I hope this video has shed light on the interesting phrase, read one's lips, and its usage in the English language. Remember, it's all about emphasizing clarity and certainty in communication. Thanks for watching, and keep exploring the fascinating world of English expressions.